World Cup authorities are expected to announce that the Argentine captain Diego Maradona is to be sent home in disgrace after failing a drugs test. He's already admitted using a banned substance. He tested positive after a random test last Saturday. Footballers, with their prowess on the pitch, are often celebrated as heroes, icons and role models. However, behind the glare of the spotlight, many have succumbed to pitfalls that have drastically affected their careers. Whether it's the intoxicating lure of alcohol, the addictive rush of gambling, or the complexities of personal relationships, these challenges have seen the decline of some of the sport's greatest talents. This video delves into the lives of 26 footballers who, despite their undeniable skills, faced significant adversities off the field. Number 1. George Best, Alcohol George Best, Northern Irish winger, blessed with extraordinary skill, vision and dribbling ability, painted both Manchester United and the world's football canvas with his artistry. He was a prodigious talent who danced through defenses, scoring astonishing goals, encapsulating the quintessence of footballing grace. However, beyond the pitch's glamour and applause, Best was embroiled in a tumultuous battle with alcoholism, a struggle as piercing and public as his stardom. His affinity for the bottle was a notorious affair that often landed him on tabloid front pages, eclipsing the headlines made by his footballing exploits. The alcohol not only blurred the luster of his professional achievements, but hastened his decline, carving out a narrative of a star who shone brightly, but briefly. Best's life off the pitch was a stark contrast to his mesmerizing runs and spectacular goals that had once sent Old Trafford into ecstatic roars. A tale of tremendous talent tarnished, leading to his premature passing at the age of 59, leaving behind legions of fans to wonder what could have been. Number 2. Paul Gascoigne, Alcohol and Amp Gambling Paul Gascoigne, or Gaza, as affectionately called, encapsulated the heartbeat of English football during his peak years. With a playing style replete with flair, creativity, and audacity, Gascoigne was the epitome of a footballing enigma. However, off the pitch, he was ensnared in a debilitating duel with alcohol and gambling. His vulnerability to these vices often cast a somber shadow over his glittering exploits in an England shirt. Gascoigne's battles were fought in the public eye. Each relapse, each descent into the throes of addiction was documented and scrutinized. It painted a narrative of a player, as brilliant as he was brittle. Gaza's footballing narrative is as much about his magical moments, like the unforgettable goal against Scotland in Euro 96, as it is about his off-field implosions. His journey serves as a poignant reminder of the inherent human fragility that even the brightest stars are not immune to, and the haunting grip of addiction that can beseech any soul, no matter how illustrious. Number 3. Tony Adams, Alcohol Tony Adams stands as an emblematic figure in the annals of Arsenal Football Club's history. Revered for his exceptional leadership and unwavering commitment on the pitch, Adams wore the captain's armband with an unparalleled distinction, leading the Gunners to multiple titles. But while his professional life was a testament to discipline and dedication, his personal life revealed a starkly different tale. Adams grappled with alcoholism, a battle that often cast a gloomy backdrop to his illustrious playing career. The indomitable defender on the field was in reality vulnerable, succumbing to the numbing allure of alcohol. His addiction reached a point where even match days were not spared, with Adams admitting to playing games under the influence. However, a testament to his strength and resilience, Adams sought help, and in the latter stages of his life, became sober. His journey towards recovery led him to found the Sporting Chance Clinic, an organization dedicated to helping athletes combat their addictions. In a life riddled with contrasts, Adams emerged not just as a footballing legend, but as an inspiring figure for countless others facing the dark abyss of addiction. Number 4. Kenny Sansom, Alcohol and Amp Gambling Kenny Sansom, the English left back, was once a stalwart of the national team, with over 80 caps to his name. His displays on the field were characterized by tenacity and tactical intelligence, making him one of the best in his position. Off the pitch, however, Sansom's life was a whirlwind of challenges. Alcohol and gambling consumed him, quickly overshadowing his accomplishments as a footballer, 
The gravity of his addictions saw him squander his earnings, descend into homelessness, and find himself at odds with the law. The player, who once graced stadiums filled with roaring fans, found solace in the clinking of glasses and the roll of dice. Sansom's personal battles were a harrowing testament to the all-consuming nature of addiction, revealing how even the most celebrated can be brought down by their personal demons. His life is a stark illustration of the fact that beneath the glittering facade of professional football, personal torment can reside, often hidden from the public gaze until it's too late. Number 5. Paul Merson, Alcohol and Gambling Paul Merson, a dynamic midfielder who adorned the English Premier League, particularly in an Arsenal jersey, was known for his deft touches and crucial goals. A part of the Gunners' golden era, Merson was integral in several of their title pursuits. However, beneath the accolades and fervor of the footballing arena, he struggled with a crippling duality of alcohol and gambling addictions. These vices drained him financially and mentally, driving a wedge between his professional prowess and personal well-being. The media often caught whiffs of his struggles, magnifying his struggles and casting him in a tumultuous light. It's a narrative all too familiar, a talented athlete's private battles overshadowing public achievements. Merson's forthrightness about his issues, particularly in his later years, brought to light the immense pressures and temptations footballers face, revealing a world not just of fame and fortune, but also of fragility and fallibility. Number 6. Garincha, Alcohol Manuel Francisco dos Santos, universally known as Garincha, remains one of Brazil's most celebrated footballing sons. With an uncanny ability to dribble past defenders and a penchant for scoring, Garincha was an embodiment of the Brazilian Samba style of football. Partnering with Pele, he delivered World Cup victories for Brazil, cementing his legendary status. Yet away from the ecstatic cheers and adoration, Garincha's life was marred by alcoholism. His addiction led to both personal and professional downfalls, with many speculating that his full potential was never truly realized due to his off-field struggles. Personal tragedies, coupled with his increasing reliance on alcohol, saw Brazil's joy of the people endure a life that was anything but joyful. His untimely demise at just 49 years of age stands as a somber reminder of the profound impact that personal challenges can have, even on those who seem invincible in their prime. Number 7. Ricardo Quaresma. Personal Issues. Ricardo Quaresma, with his trademark Trivella technique and flair on the wings, dazzled fans across Europe. His journey across clubs like Sporting CP, Porto, and Besiktas showcased his undeniable talent, but Quaresma's career trajectory also bore the weight of personal issues that often hindered his growth at pivotal moments. While his skills were exceptional, he was frequently criticized for inconsistency, attributed to off-pitch distractions and disputes with coaches. These personal rifts often led to transfers, loans, and intermittent phases of underperformance, despite the promise he consistently showcased. Quaresma's talent was undeniable, but the alignment of personal temperament with professional demands was a challenge he faced throughout his career. His journey underscores the complexities athletes face in balancing talent with temperament and the profound role personal challenges can play in shaping one's professional narrative. Number 8. Ronaldinho. Financial Issues. The name Ronaldinho evokes memories of bewitching skill, infectious smiles, and football played with pure joy. Widely regarded as one of the game's greatest, the Brazilian maestro's on-field antics are the stuff of legends. However, the latter part of Ronaldinho's life saw him grapple with financial issues, a stark contrast to the lavish lifestyle he once enjoyed. His financial decline was exacerbated by legal troubles in Paraguay over passport fraud, resulting in detention. These off-field challenges painted a somber picture, juxtaposing the vibrant and celebratory persona fans adored on the pitch. Ronaldinho's financial woes serve as a poignant reminder that fame and fortune are transient, and even the brightest stars can face challenges that dim their once shining light. Number 9. Jimmy Greaves, Alcohol Jimmy Greaves, a titan of English football, boasts a goal-scoring record that few can rival. With an innate ability to find the back of the net, he enthralled fans at clubs like Tottenham Hotspur and Chelsea, 
not to mention his notable contributions to the England national team. But as is often the case with individuals possessing immense talent, Greaves was not without his personal battles. Alcoholism gripped him, casting a shadow over the twilight of his playing days and the years that followed. His addiction took a toll on both his health and personal relationships, leading him down a path of rehab and recovery. The challenges were profound, but Greaves, showing the same determination that made him a legend on the pitch, combated his demons and emerged in later years as an advocate for those facing similar struggles. His journey from the highs of footballing glory to the lows of personal adversity is a poignant reflection on the complexities of life's challenges. Number 10. Frank Worthington. Lifestyle Choices. Frank Worthington was as flamboyant off the pitch as he was on it. His footballing career, spanning more than two decades, showcased a forward with flair, panache, and an eye for the spectacular. But away from the stadiums, Worthington's lifestyle was filled with excesses. Known for his love of nightclubs, music, and the allure of the spotlight, he embodied the rock star footballer persona before it was a norm. These lifestyle choices, while adding to his legend, often conflicted with the discipline required for a professional athlete. Managers and teammates frequently bemoaned his nocturnal tendencies, feeling that his off-pitch activities impeded his full potential. Despite the criticisms, Worthington remained unapologetic, living life on his terms. His story is a testament to the intricate balance between personal freedom and professional responsibility, a dance that few can master. Number 11. Mickey Thomas. Gambling. Mickey Thomas, a Welshman with a tenacity and fervor for football, graced pitches with clubs ranging from Manchester United to Chelsea. His presence was unmistakable, not just for his skills, but for his fighting spirit. However, parallel to his on-field endeavors, Thomas was ensnared in the vice grip of gambling. The allure of the bet, the thrill of the risk, became as much a part of his life as football. His gambling habits grew alarmingly, leading to considerable debts and financial strains. The off-pitch predicament escalated to a point where Thomas found himself embroiled in counterfeit money scandals, marking a dramatic fall from grace. The tale of Mickey Thomas serves as a stark reminder of the hazards of addiction and how swiftly it can overshadow a life, even one illuminated by the spotlight of professional football. Number 12. Chris Waddle personal choices. Chris Waddle's name evokes memories of a player with innate dribbling abilities and an iconic mullet hairstyle, a symbol of his nonconformity. Throughout his career, spanning clubs like Tottenham Hotspur and Marseille, Waddle showcased a unique blend of skill and individuality. But with his distinct style came personal choices that often set him apart. Rejecting conventional norms both in his play and life, Waddle charted a path that was undeniably his own. From decisions to pursue a music career to his unconventional journey into professional football, starting in the non-league world, Waddle's personal choices were as talked about as his curling free kicks. His story underscores the essence of individuality, showcasing that a footballer's journey isn't just about talent, but also the choices they make along the way. Number 13. Keith Gillespie, Gambling Keith Gillespie, a Northern Irish winger, brought zest and dynamism to the sides he played for, most notably Newcastle United and Blackburn Rovers. His electric pace and crossing ability made him a formidable force on the flanks. Yet, away from the roar of the crowds and the adrenaline of matches, Gillespie faced an insidious opponent, gambling. The lure of quick wins and the thrill of the game consumed him, leading to financial turmoil. As his earnings soared, so did his stakes, resulting in losses amounting to millions. His addiction became public knowledge, drawing attention to the lesser-discussed issue of gambling within the football community. Gillespie's battles serve as a cautionary tale about the pitfalls that can accompany fame and fortune, emphasizing the need for financial guidance and support for athletes prone to such temptations. Number 14. Stan Bowles, Gambling Stan Bowles, often regarded as one of English football's most gifted talents, lit up pitches during the 1970s, primarily with Queen's Park Rangers. With an innate ability to glide past defenders and a vision for the sublime, Bowles was, on his day, unplayable. But accompanying his on-field genius was a penchant for the gambling tables. 
Bowles was as familiar with the inside of betting shops as he was with football grounds. His high-stakes bets became legendary, but so did the substantial debts he accrued. This addiction, unchecked and rampant, took a toll on his finances and later life. While Bowles remains an icon for his footballing prowess, his story also paints a vivid picture of the perils of gambling, especially in the high-pressure world of professional sports. Number 15. Lee Hendry, Financial Issues Lee Hendry, a name synonymous with Aston Villa during the late 1990s and early 2000s, was a dynamic midfielder, known for his ability to link play and chip in with vital goals. His dedication on the pitch earned him accolades and a lifestyle that many only dream of. However, with the trappings of success came significant financial misjudgments. Investments gone awry, excessive spending, and an inability to manage the affluence that football brought led to severe financial distress for Hendry. Bankruptcy and personal turmoil followed, presenting a stark contrast to the player once hailed as a Premier League mainstay. His struggles underscore the importance of financial literacy and guidance for players thrust into wealth at young ages, highlighting the transient nature of footballing success and its accompanying fortunes. Number 16. Dietmar Hamann, Gambling Dietmar Hamann, the German midfield maestro, is fondly remembered for his days at Liverpool, where his calm demeanor and tactical acumen played a pivotal role in the team's successes. A Champions League winner and a key figure for the German national team, Hamann's credentials on the pitch were impeccable. However, beneath this composed exterior lay a tumultuous relationship with gambling. Racing bets, poker games, and high-stakes wagers became an integral part of his life, leading to significant financial losses and personal strain. The juxtaposition of Heyman's on-field discipline against his off-field gambling woes paints a complex portrait of a man battling internal demons. His candid revelations about his addiction have shed light on the pressures and pitfalls that accompany the life of a top-tier footballer emphasizing the need for mental health support and addiction counseling in the sport. Number 17. Robin Friday, Lifestyle Choices Robin Friday, often dubbed the greatest footballer you never saw, remains an enigmatic figure in English football history. Friday dazzled on the pitch with audacious skill and an innate knack for goal scoring. Yet his off-field antics were just as legendary as his footballing exploits. A life filled with excessive drinking, confrontations, and a flagrant disregard for discipline often landed him in hot water. His rebellious nature and hedonistic lifestyle choices led to a short-lived career, curtailing what many believed could have been a trajectory to the very pinnacle of the sport. Despite his ephemeral stint in football, the stories of his talent and tumult live on, painting a vivid picture of a player whose lifestyle choices overshadowed his prodigious talent. Number 18. Jermaine Pennant, Lifestyle Choices Jermaine Pennant, with spells at clubs like Liverpool and Arsenal, was once touted as one of English football's most promising wingers. His pace and crossing abilities earned him acclaim and a place in top-flight football. However, Pennant's career was frequently marred by his off-field choices. From brushes with the law, including imprisonments, to high-profile tabloid stories about his personal life, Pennant was often in the limelight for reasons other than football. These lifestyle choices impacted his consistency on the field, leading to a career that, while successful, might have promised even more. Pennant's journey serves as a stark reminder of the challenges young talents face, navigating the seductions and pitfalls of fame in the unforgiving world of professional football. Number 19. Mark Bosnich, Alcohol and Amp Drugs Mark Bosnich, the Australian goalkeeper, established himself as a formidable presence between the posts for clubs like Aston Villa and Manchester United. His agility and shot-stopping abilities earned him plaudits in the Premier League during the late 1990s. But as his star rose, so did his engagement with off-pitch vices. Bosnich's battles with alcohol and drugs became increasingly public, leading to friction with managers and affecting his performance on the field. A notable low came when he was handed a lengthy ban due to drug use, pushing him further from the footballing limelight. His struggles with addiction served as a painful juxtaposition to his earlier successes, marking a precipitous fall for a player who once seemed destined for consistent top-tier triumphs. Bosnick's tale underscores the pressures of elite football and the seductive dangers that can accompany fame. 
Number 20. Ian Redford, Depression and Amp, Personal Tragedies Ian Redford, a stalwart of Scottish football during the 1980s, graced clubs like Rangers and Dundee United with his midfield prowess. Yet behind the scenes, Redford faced profound personal challenges. The weight of depression, compounded by personal tragedies, including the devastating. Loss of a young sibling cast long shadows over his playing days. While his footballing abilities remained evident, the emotional toll these challenges exacted on Redford was immense. His struggles, largely private during his playing days, became more public following his untimely death. Redford's story serves as a poignant reminder of the often unseen mental and emotional battles that players face, emphasizing the urgent need for mental health support within the footballing community. Number 21. David James, Financial Issues David James, the towering English goalkeeper with an illustrious career spanning clubs like Liverpool, Manchester City, and Portsmouth, was a mainstay in the Premier League and the English national side. Known for his reflexes and commanding presence, James carved out a reputation as one of England's finest shot stoppers. However, off the pitch, his financial misadventures painted a contrasting narrative. Despite earning sizable wages throughout his lengthy career, James found himself facing bankruptcy. A series of ill-advised investments, coupled with a penchant for collecting memorabilia and luxury items, led to his financial undoing. The scale of his monetary woes shocked many, offering a cautionary tale about the fleeting nature of footballing fortunes and the need for prudent financial planning. Number 22. Jibril Sissi. Lifestyle Choices. Jibril. Sissy, with his unmistakable hairstyles and vibrant fashion sense, was as much a character off the field as he was a force on it. Plying his trade with clubs such as Liverpool and Marseille, Sissy's pace and goal-scoring ability were often the talk of the town. Yet, his lifestyle choices, marked by flamboyance and a penchant for the limelight, frequently drew attention. High-profile parties, engagement with the fashion world, and occasionally controversial appearances in the media spotlight made Sissy as much a tabloid fixture as a footballing icon. While his zest for life was evident, it sometimes led to perceptions of a distracted commitment to his footballing craft. Sissy's story is emblematic of the modern footballer's challenge, navigating the allure of fame while maintaining professional focus. Number 23. John Arne Rees personal issues. John Arne Rise, the Norwegian left back with a thunderous left foot, is best remembered for his tenure at Liverpool, where his blistering strikes and dedicated performances etched his name into Anfield lore. While Rise basked in the adulation of the cop off the pitch, he grappled with personal challenges that added layers of complexity to his public image. Rees's familial relationships, notably strained ties with his brother, often became public knowledge, revealing tensions that stood in sharp contrast to the unity he displayed with teammates on the field. The weight of personal feuds, coupled with high-profile incidents like the infamous altercation with Craig Bellamy, cast a shadow over his otherwise shining career. Despite these challenges, Reese's resilience saw him don the red shirt with commitment, reminding fans and critics alike of the multifaceted lives athletes lead, where personal struggles and professional triumphs often coexist. Number 24. Mauro Icardi. Personal Controversies. Mauro Icardi, the Argentine striker, has been no stranger to headlines, both for his prolific goal-scoring prowess and his entanglements in personal controversies. Plying his trade primarily at Inter Milan and Paris Saint-Germain, Icardi's clinical finishes have made him a coveted asset on the pitch. However, his personal life, marked notably by his relationship with Wanda Nara, former wife of his friend and teammate Maxi Lopez, has been a focal point of controversy. This off-pitch drama often. Overshadowed Icardi's contributions on the field, leading to strained relationships within the locker room and with fans. His story, replete with captaincies, has made Icardi one of the most talked-about figures in modern football illustrating the blurred lines between personal choices and professional ramifications in the age of relentless media scrutiny. Number 25. Adriano, Personal Tragedies Adriano Light Ribeiro, simply known as Adriano, was a force of nature on the football pitch. 
His explosive power and lethal left foot made him a nightmare for defenders and a beacon of hope for Brazilian football in the early 2000s. Playing for clubs like Parma, Inter Milan, and Flamengo, Adriano seemed destined for legendary status. However, behind his formidable on-field presence lay a heart grappling with profound personal tragedies. The unexpected death of his father dealt Adriano a blow from which he struggled to recover. This devastating loss affected his mental well-being and motivation, leading to a decline in form and a retreat from the European footballing limelight. His struggles underscore the immense mental and emotional toll personal tragedies can have on individuals, even those seemingly at the pinnacle of their profession. Adriano's tale is a poignant reminder that behind every athlete's facade lies a human being, vulnerable to the same tragedies and trials we all face. Number 26. Diego Maradona, Alcohol and Amp Drugs Diego Maradona, often celebrated as one of the greatest footballers of all time, was an enigma both on and off the field. His unparalleled skills, epitomized by the hand of God and his solo goal against England in the 1986 World Cup, cemented his legendary status. However, the same passion that drove Maradona on the pitch also led him down perilous paths off it. His struggles with alcohol and drug addiction became public spectacles, often overshadowing his footballing genius. These addictions, combined with health issues, culminated in a life that, while filled with dazzling highs, also saw tragic lows. Maradona's life story serves as a stark reflection of the dual nature of fame, bringing with it unparalleled adoration, but also exposing one's vulnerabilities to the world. The tale of Maradona is a testament to the human behind the legend, flawed yet brilliant in equal measure.